In 2002, Brad Bushman from Iowa State University carried out an experiment where 600 students were asked to write an essay on their views on abortion. The essays were then taken away and marked by the experimenters, although the participants were told that their essay was evaluated by another student. The experimenters gave all students bad marks and negative feedback and a note saying this is the worst essay I have ever read. This made the participants very angry. A group of participants were then allowed to vent out their steam by first showing them the photograph of the alleged evaluator and a 70 pound punch bag to hit as much as they please while thinking about their fictitious evaluator. An intercom system allowed the experimenters to secretly count the number of times they hit the bag. Another group were instead asked to sit in a quiet room for two minutes. After this, each participant was given a standard mood questionnaire about how angry, frustrated and annoyed they felt. Next, the game was played, where the winning participant had the opportunity to blast a loud noise into the face of the losing evaluator, where the winner could choose how long and how loud the blast would be. Results showed that those who had participated in the punching exercise were more aggressive and administered louder and longer blasts. So what's going on here? Does venting your anger really work? Does just sitting quietly in a room make any difference? <coughs> Results show that for those who had spent time punching the bags, not only did not feel any better, but in fact they felt more aggressive and furious than before the punching exercise. Those who had simply sat quietly in a room for just a short period of time felt much more peaceful. So next time you're feeling angry or frustrated, find somewhere quiet and sit down for a few minutes. Your peace of mind may just be a seat away. Have a wacky wisdom day.